Boris has surrendered. Brexit fury as PM caves on fishing and hands major win to France. Boris Johnson has come under furious attack after being accused of breaking Brexit promises and capitulating to France in the bitter war of words over fishing rights. The feud appears to have ended after the European Union Fishing Commissioner said all licenses requested by French boats to operate in UK coastal waters had been granted, with around 70 permits outstanding. The Brexit deal signed at the end of 2020 ensured the UK's share of fishing quotas in its waters jumped by 25% from 2021 to 2026. But in territorial waters 6 to 12 miles from the coast, Britain had granted permission for French vessels who had previously fished there to continue. The two countries have been feuding over the issue ever since which has seen French boats blocking the harbours in Jersey and France threatening to ask the EU to take legal action over the matter. But in a major twist, EU Fishing Commissioner Virginia Jacinkovicius told the Financial Times. The Commission fully intends to continue building a successful and constructive relationship with the UK. We managed to achieve most of the licences that have been requested. This has sparked a furious reaction from Brexiteer and former Brexit Party MEP Ben Habib, who accused Mr Johnson of surrendering the UK's fishing rights. He told Express.co.uk, It is the typical Boris Johnson and UK government approach to all our dealings with the EU, lots of bluster, lots of apparent resistance, a big public spat but then we capitulate. That's what we did in the run-up to the withdrawal agreement in 2019, the Trade and Cooperation Agreement in 2020 and were busy capitulating on the Northern Ireland Protocol. This was the last bit of defence we had on fishing but in all respect, we had already surrendered that anyway and we have surrendered these last bits too. All I see is a government unable and incapable of standing up to the EU. Mr Habib accused the Prime Minister of breaking promises around the fishing rights of UK fishermen, describing the major capitulation as an utter disaster. He continued, this fishing truce is the last little bit of major capitulation.